Welcome to the channel everybody, Project C28 here, and girlfriend's not with me this time, she is sadly working, but I have a very long-awaited unboxing that I've been just itching to open and share with you guys. So, without further ado, we're going to go ahead and open the PlayStation 4 Avengers Collector's Edition. Before we get started, be sure to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to keep yourself updated on any more cool unboxings like this. This is actually kind of a first for me. I haven't ever unboxed anything like collector's edition related in like PS4 and stuff like that. We've done video game reviews and we've done unboxings with Funko Pops and stuff. This is kind of a first, so I'm actually really excited to see how this looks. So just to kind of get started with it, um, I actually ordered this from GameStop. If you guys are familiar with anything like that, uh, you pre-order the game uh, from GameStop specifically for this one. Um, but with GameStop, I actually got some free pins and I'm actually going to pull these out because I know these uh, the plastic on here is a little shiny so I wanted to show you guys the pins I got stuck right there all right cool so when you pre-order from I think GameStop I don't know if this is exclusively GameStop the GameStop um, but these are the pins that I got for pre-ordering and these things are really cool and I'm a big fan of pins so this is awesome. So I'll probably wear this like on a little like name tag or something at work. But uh, these are really cool. I really like all of these. Um, I am kind of surprised that these ones aren't in like color or something. Or like they even don't have like an Avengers A like this, but that's okay too. Anyway, these things are really cool. So I just wanted to show those off real quick. But I want to say these were exclusively for GameStop uh, pre-orders only. Um, as far as I know, I don't know if there's anything else to that. But uh, anyway, so let's get on to this box here. What is super cool, and I found out is exclusively only to PlayStation, is that later, I don't know when it's gonna be announced, but we are getting Spider-Man as a DLC character, which I'm very excited for. Um, also, let me know down in the comments below if you guys actually played the beta when it was available for, I think, PlayStation, or I don't know if it was available for any of the other systems. But um, let me know if you played the beta, if you didn't play the beta, or if you're just here for the first time, just, uh, watching me unbox something, let me know down in the comments. I would love to hear from you and maybe we can chat about it. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started. So as you can see, it has the big Avengers logo here. It has that cool little sticker for Spider-Man being an exclusive to PlayStation. Um, I know a lot of people are really upset about that. Not much going on on the side. Uh, same thing with this side here, Avengers A on the top. Now I noticed this is actually a big sleeve. So I'm actually gonna tear this thing off in a second. But on the back here, it does show a cheat sheet but uh, we're just gonna open the box. So, I'm gonna start here. And what I really like about this, this little plastic thing here, um, it, it gets all like messed up and, you know, takes a lot of beatings and stuff like that. But uh, the box itself isn't damaged or scratched up whatsoever, so. There's a little couple, or there's a couple little dings in here and there and stuff, but you can't really control that. But anyway, um, so far uh, they released the beta um, a couple weeks ago. Um, I know this is kind of a little bit of a late unboxing, but I actually had some issues with my PS4 that uh, were kind of stupid, like there's some just stupid things going on with it as far as like the engineering. But then all of a sudden it started working again. I don't know. It's really weird. Anyway, let's get on to this here. Uh, this is gonna be in a little sleeve, so we're actually gonna pull this out this way. And, ooh, that's cool, man. All right, so we're gonna look at this. We're not gonna look at the cheat sheet together. I could physically see it. I know you guys can't right now, but we're gonna move this to the side here. And this looks super cool. Okay, so it looks like this has like this um, embossed type of like metallic or not metallic a shiny little paint team to it uh, same thing here this is uh, I want to say it's the spot varnished or something like that it's basically like a holographic but you can feel the matte finish on here but when you go over this part here it's like really like um, reflective and all that stuff so that looks really cool I don't know if it's on the front side but okay so it says the Avengers logo there on the sides again not really much going here but this part is actually really cool. You can see all the different little logos right there. That's kind of cool. All right, so let's go ahead and take this thing off. Pull this up. Very cool. Ooh, this is a really durable box. I like that. I might keep it for something else. This is pretty cool. 
I might, I don't know, I might keep comics or something in this box after that. Oops. Oops. I'll just leave it down right there. Okay, cool. So this comes with, I think these are blueprints from what I had seen on the back. This is a picture of the Avengers all together. Looks really realistic. Uh, so this here, let's see what this is. Ah, okay. So in the front, it shows Iron Man right there. Nothing on the back. These are blueprints in another piece of plastic. And let's see. So we'll start with a question. If you've gotten this far, let me know. Um, but you'll, well, I'll know if you actually answer this question. Who is your favorite Avenger and why? Leave that down in the comments below, and I would like to hear what you have to say about that. So moving on to this portion here. This is pretty interesting. Wow. Oh, wow. That's really cool. So this right here is a blueprint sheet of Iron Man's suit. That's pretty cool. Little neat collector's edition thing. Oh. Very cool. I like that. This... Wow, whoa, this is really cool. All right, I'm really excited to play the game. Um, if you guys would like to see a video game review of this, uh, like the video. Like the video, and uh, if we get to 100 likes, I'll get a review out for this thing. So anyway, this right here is a steel book. Very cool, nice little um, embossed uh, logo there. You can kind of feel the grooves within the A. Kind of got that... Um, not really circuit board, but all those, uh, uh, I want to say those are octagons, right? One, two, four, six. Yeah, I think it's octagon shapes all right there. Then you have all the Avengers logo that are in the game right there. And then soon to be announced more of them. Very cool. And then this right here is pretty interesting. I know this um, from the beta that I played, this is actually part of the game. Um, I, I want to say. Um, this is supposed to be like a replica for an in-game, or for the in-game experience or something. And it's a photo of what they called A-Day. And this shows, uh, it shows Iron Man, Captain America going from right to left. Uh, uh, Iron Man, Captain America, Kamala Khan, uh, Bruce Banner, Black Widow, and it looks like Thor. And it says Avengers Day, which A-Day. And uh, it's in San Francisco. Very cool. Very cool to see that. And then on the back it says, finally met my heroes. And one day they'll reassemble. Uh, hashtag Marvel. Or copyright Marvel. <laughs> Down at the bottom right there. So I assume that has something to do with the game. Um, I only know a little bit of the beta. They didn't really give much of the story away, which is kind of nice. Um, we just know that the Avengers are supposed to reassemble. Uh, something there was a big like uh, falling out or something like that. Um, but anyway, I'll shoot for that. Looks like a Tika caught onto this. Cool. Okay. Whoops. Okay. So I'm gonna put this to the side. This is kind of cool. Not not usually something you get from a, a lot of collector's edition. I don't usually buy collector's editions that much. So this is kind of a fun little neat thing to do. This looks like it is stuck to something or picking something up. Oh. Oh, okay, I see. All right, so let me see. This piece here looks like this pops up and this I don't know what this is. Hopefully it's not a game spoiler or anything like that. It's a pin. Two pin. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so this might be something that you get in game. But it looks like they made it for uh, the collector's edition. And I was just saying, didn't I? I just said that they should do something like uh, have an Avengers A, but that's super cool. I'm glad this is on there. That's really awesome. All right, very cool. So we'll put this inside over here, and then now we can take this piece off. I'm gonna try to... Cool, so that's how that works there. This also... Oh, okay. Oh man, so we'll open this up last. I'm gonna put this right over here for right now, because it looks like we have a couple other things we're gonna open up. This here is a block of nothing. So we'll put that there, we'll put this, this has something to do with Thor, and it's, uh, looks, oh yeah, okay. So this here is a box full of something, and this is Thor's hammer. It's Mjolnir, forged from a dying star. 
and oh wow this has got some weight to it snap this is really cool okay so this right here is a i assume a replica of his of his uh hammer and that's really cool it's just a cool little keychain very cool and uh, it doesn't look like it swivels on any hooks or anything like that, but it's sculpted really nicely. And it's die cast, that's always nice. So I'll put that right there for right now. That's cool, I like that. I don't know if it'll go on my keys because it's, you know, heavier than uh, a star. Huh. If you get that reference, you should like the video. Huh. Uh, it's supposed to be funny, but it's, it's... Anyway, moving on, there's this right here. This looks like, it's got the Black Widow logo right there. Oh, I forgot to mention, this one here, that's why I said it was Thor related. Sorry, forgot to mention that. Okay, so moving on. We have this here. This is a belt buckle? No way. Oh, wow, that's really cool. Come on. Come on. Okay, got it. Very cool. This is, um... Got the serial number on the back. It says Marvel made in China. It's not made in America. And cool. That's really cool. I like it. And it's a uh, die cast. So if you wanted to. Yeah. Very cool. Very nice looking. Nice gold and uh, red. Very crimson. Very bloody looking. Because she's an assassin. Because she's, you know, she kills people. Anyway, moving on to the next thing. We have that right there. Put this here. And this has the Hulk on it. Now, I think I have an idea of what this is. I think this is supposed to be, yep. Supposed to be a bobblehead. Little bobblehead, not a pop, not a Funko Pop. But uh, it says, love Tony. So I wonder if there's a reference to this in the video game or something. And it looks like he's saying, oh. I'm so angry. <laughs> okay, I'm laughing at myself. I'm having too much fun with nothing. Okay, so that's basically it. Oh, that. Uh, okay, so let's go ahead and put all this stuff back in here. I'm not going to clean it up. I'll do that on camera. So, cool. That's really cool. And the box, box is really durable. Um, like I said, I'm going to keep this box. This box is really cool. All right, I'm going to move this over. No. That, let's see if that, that'll work right there. Okay, this is the big reason everybody pre-ordered this thing. And it's so cool. If you've gotten this far in the video, uh, what could you say? You could do um, uh, open the last piece or open the last item or something. I don't know. Let me know you've gotten this far. All right. So this, ooh, this is really cool. To be completely honest, I did not expect this to be in color. This thing looks gorgeous, man. Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow. This is, oh man. This is really cool. And this is a quote. Okay, you guys ready? You guys ready for the big collector's edition reveal? Ready, three, two, one. Captain America statue. This thing is so nice, man. The paint on this thing looks really nice. The sculpt on it's really good. It better not be super brittle, because that would really suck. Uh, the helmet looks really cool. The shield looks amazing, man. The paint on this looks really, really glossy. So on the front right here, here I'll just show it off right there. This thing looks really nice. I really like this. And you don't really see very many, like, collector's editions like this that have, you know, such good paint and detail on it. Man, that is so nice. Okay, so the little plaque right here on the front, it says, this nation was founded on one principle above all else. The, re uh, the requirement that we stand up for what we believe, uh, no, matter, uh, no matter the odds or the consequences. Steve Rogers, Captain America. That's super cool, man. There you go. This is really cool. I really like this. The sculpting on this is really nice. So if you want, you can read that for yourself right there. But there's also an Avengers A on the back right there. This thing is so nice. Again, I don't know why I didn't think this was going to be in color, but I'm glad it is. So anyway, this is really cool. So 
yeah, I think that's everything. This is, uh, we have this right, the statue, we have the game, we have uh, the, oh my gosh, bubblehead. We have this belt buckle that's not going to stand, I think, at all. Okay, that's it. I have a feeling it's going to slide down. This, and then we have the pin and the blueprints and all that stuff right there. Give me one moment. And that's the unboxing, everybody. I really hope you guys had a fun time with me. This was really cool. Um, again, if we can get this video to about 100 likes, I will make sure this gets reviewed. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for, you know, sticking around and having fun with me with this little unboxing. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to keep yourself updated on any videos, unboxings, reviews, reactions, all that cool fun stuff. And also be sure to follow on Facebook and on Instagram. And without further ado, be sure to wash your hands, brush your teeth, keep yourself clean, and stay safe out there. And I'll see you guys in the next video.